Assalamualaikum and greetings everyone. I'm Iqbal Yusuf and this is TVS News, September 5th edition. The latest animal samples sent to the Poor Veterinary Research Institute were found to be all negative of rabies virus. Deputy Chief Minister Tamara Douglas Ngamba said the samples from Syrian Kuching Sriaman Lundu Tebedu, Lubu Antu Batulintang Mongkos and Sirikin were sent to the Poor Veterinary Research Institute for tests recently. He told these two reporters after officiating the Sarawak Agriculture Institute at 12th convocation ceremony in Kuching. According to him, the Sarawak Veterinary Department will continue to collect animal samples, especially in towns and villages along the border, and send to the Ipoh Veterinary Research Institute to determine the spread of rabies. The Pamakai, Manoa and Pulau Galau Committee is trying its level best to seek solutions to the issue over the two categories of land. Disclosing the matter, Deputy Chief Minister Dr. Amara Douglas Ngambasa believed that there should be solutions, adding that he would not be able to tell more until something more concrete came up. He said this in response to a question during a press conference after launching the 12th Convocation of Agriculture Institute of Sarawak in Kuching. Philippine President Rory Duterte will meet with leaders from Malaysia and Indonesia to formalize details of an anti-terrorism deal. Duterte said he, Indonesian President Joko Widodo and Malaysian Prime Minister Dato Sri Najib Tun Raza agreed to meet in an area near the Philippines like Sabah or Jakarta. In all probability, Duterte said the deal could be a joint undertaking like a task force to run after IS members. Former Inspector General Police Tan Sri Khalid Abu Bakar has been appointed the new Prasarana Malaysia Berhad Group Chairman. Prime Minister Dato Sri Najib Tun Razak also announced Khalid's appointment as Special Ambassador to enhance relations and cooperation with the international community in the fight against terrorism, extremism and human trafficking. Khalid's appointment as Prasarana Chairman comes after former Chairman Tan Sri Ismail Adam's tenure ended on August 31st. That's all for me. For more news, go to tvsrock.com. Don't forget to share this video. I'm Iqbal Yusuf. Thanks for watching.